Hey, what is going on guys? I am the Explosive Gamer and welcome to my first uh, confirmed things in Advanced Warfare. I'll be doing this as more of a news thing that I did last year for Ghosts. Uh, less professionally. This is still not so professional, but uh, lower quality, I guess, was last year. And now this is better quality and uh, just better in general. So here we are on Call of Duty Wikia. Dot com. So it's Call of Duty Wikia. Dot com slash wiki slash what Advanced Warfare or Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. So we're starting out here with the confirmed, all the confirmed perks, all the confirmed wild cards, and all the confirmed kill streaks. So let's get right into this. As we are starting with our tier one perks, so we have low profile, lightweight. Danger Close and Flak Jacket. So two new perks here. Low profile uh, hides you from UAVs and some sort of. Uh, here, let me let me check again. But it hides you from UAVs and some kind of rounds. What are they? Tracking rounds. Uh, this is really cool and uh, may or may not use. It sounds kind of like Ghosts or uh, Off the Grid from Ghosts. So, uh, get on to our next cool new perk here, which is Overcharge. A tier 1 perk in the upcoming game, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. The player will have an extended battery life for his EXO ability. So your EXO abilities have a little battery bar, and they only last for a certain amount of time, and they recharge, I'm assuming. So, uh, or something like that. So when you have this perk, they, uh, don't, I, I think they take just as long to charge, uh, per, like, uh, amount per second. I think percentage per second is, is the same. But um, there's more, there you have a longer battery life, so that's really cool. Uh, tier 2 perks we have Blind Eye, Peripherals, Fast Hands, Cold Blooded, and Gung Ho. So, our first cool one here is Peripherals. Um, I don't know this one. <laughs> wow. Excuse me. Um, so, Peripherals, uh, it is, so we're seeing the multiplayer reveal for at Gamescom, it, is, it increases the radius of your mini map. And prevents death icons from appearing when enemies on the appearing when enemy is killed. So it, it's it's like takedown from ghosts combined with the brand new part, which uh, shows uh, increase the size of your increase the radius of your mini map, which is really cool. That's that's very new and never I never would have thought of that to be a cool perk, but it actually is. So we got fast hands, which is coming back from Black Ops 2. Same as sight of hand, cold blooded, coming back, uh, gong a ho. Uh, tier two perk. It was there the. Player can fire their weapon while sprinting and sliding. I'm using this. I don't care about all the other shit in this. I'm using this. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm using. So here, here's my tier, my perk setup for tier one and two so far. I'm probably going to use overcharged or lightweight, and then gung ho for my second one. Tier two perk. Okay, third tier tier three perk. Toughness, scavenger, uh, blast suppressor, hardwired, and hardline. So toughness, it's coming back from Black Ops, just less flinch. Scavenger, everyone knows it. Blast suppressor, I'm assuming, is like blast shield. Slim, similar to suppressor, blast suppressor. Uh, uh, the player won't show up on the mini map when using XL movements. You show up on the mini map when you use XL movements. That's cool. So everyone will be always on the mini map, pretty much, because everyone's going to be always using XL movements. That's cool. Um, so you don't do that. It's like, um, hmm, that's cool. I'm probably gonna be using scavengers still, like always. Okay, here let's go to our wild cards. Perk one greed, perk two greed, perk three greed, streaker overkill, primary gunfire, secondary gunfire, tactician, and bombardier. So there's one new thing I see here. Streaker. That's the only new thing because tactician and bombardier are obvious. Um, it allows the player to select a fourth kill streak. Oh, you need a wild card for that. Oh, I didn't know that. I thought that was just available. That sucks. Anyway, that's cool. Anyway, moving to our score streaks here, because everything else there was is coming back, right? Yeah. Uh, score streaks. UAV orbital care package, remote turret, XS1 Vulcan, uh, bomb run, warbird, XS1 Goliath, paladin, missile strike, aerial assault drone, Oh my god, stop ad. Mute. There we go. Uh, aerial Assault Drone, Aerial Recon Drone, Ground Proximity Turret. So, 
starting with our UAV here, care package, uh, remote turret, which is something you control. So it's like the uh, remote sentry from MW3, uh, the XS1 Vulcan. That's something new. Let's look at this. What's the XS1 Vulcan? Uh, score streak in the upcoming game. Players will take their tablet and take control of a state, a satellite that rains down a laser beam. That's a low kill streak. I don't think there's all gonna be on this order, but uh, but a, a Vulcan looks is, is a low kill streak. Someone only I think a seven kill streak. Uh, I'm gonna look, I'm gonna look at remote trade to make sure I know what I'm talking about. But that sounds cool, the Vulcan. Um, I would uh, that's something I'd recommend. But yeah, it is a, it is a remote sentry. I was right with the remote turret thing. Um, here, what's this next one? Bombing run. So I'm assuming that's like an airstrike. Yeah, it's call streak. Uh, the bombing one is a 600 point. It doesn't give me information, any information about it, or a picture. I think I think it's a bombing run. It's like a like a, a, a dropping thing. Warbird. Information. 700 point kill streak. Uh, when called in. Players will take control of a VTOL aircraft armed with heavy explosive weapons, dual miniguns, similar to the VTOL warship in Black Ops 2. In addition, no, the co-op kill... It's a co-op course score streak? An ally player can join and support who is using the score streak, thus taking control of another turret in the aircraft. Two people controlling it! That's awesome! I wonder, how much is the XS1 Vulcan? Does it say? A 600. 600 point kill streak, a 6 kill streak for the for the laser satellite. XS1 Goliath. An 800 point streak. Uh, it is a manually piloted suit of advanced armor with heavy weapons. Players have the capability to self destruct the suit. So, it is a mech suit with self destruct abilities and mini guns, like dual ass, big ass mini guns that go brrrr and shoot people to. Dolly awesomeness. Okay, we got the Paladin. What's the Paladin? Uh, it's a, it doesn't even say how much it is. Oh, it's rolled at 900 points. It doesn't say what it used for. Missile Strike is that thing with a spiral missile strike that was in the in the, in the trailer. In Call of Duty Ghost, the field alert is on the map Siege. What map was Siege? Okay, anyway. Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Uh, a large amount of missiles will rain down upon one spot choosing uh, to the players choosing killing multiple enemies in a blast radius similar to predator missiles and hellstorm missiles and Trinidad missiles I don't know like it's that's cool um, I'm probably I'm probably gonna use that that sounds like a cool cool kill streak um, so let's go to assault aerial assault drone uh, is, re is rewarded at 450 points no uh, anything about that but I think it's it's, it's like it it's like the the uh, the uh, back no, the what's that what was the name of that uh, kill streaking ghost with the the Vulcan the Vulcan or the Vulcan or something something that like the, the, the it flew around behind you and it it was like it was like a guard dog with a gun anyway aerial recon drone uh, is rewarded at 300 points. Uh, it doesn't say what it does. Um, that's cool. Ground proximity turret, which is a, does not, the, the article for ground proximity turret does not exist. So I'm assuming the ground proximity turret is like a uh, sentry gun. I'm assuming. I'm assuming that's what it's like and it sounds, Sounds legit. So anyway, guys, hope you all enjoyed this uh, video. It was pretty long, nine minutes, ten minutes. Uh, anyway, uh, if you want to see the next video, will be on the guns that are confirmed to be in Advanced Warfare. So be sure to come check that out. Anyway, guys, remember to like and share the videos of the channel. And subscribe if you haven't already. And if you want to see more videos from me, uh, I'll also go click on my channel to go see the rest of my videos. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.